Hello everyone and welcome to Radical Red. Today I'm um, I'm gonna not I'm not gonna throw the game or anything like that. I'm only show you how you best can train uh, your Pokemon. If you are now Radical Red, is a really uh, difficult ROM hack from the original Fire Red and Leaf Green. And I'm gonna show you here in this little tile grass how you actually can train your Pokemon. So let's go and uh, let's battle some wild Pokemon right here. So basically, you're gonna train your Pokemon. And since it's all randomized, uh, it's, uh, it's a little bit difficult, but I'm not a little challenge. So basically what you do is you're attacking the Pokemon until you can level up. I don't know if it's gonna happen in this video, but um, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try. Oh, it's gonna happen, okay, well. Channel Flame is now level 14, and if you go into your team, actually you're going into your Pokemon, and then basically see this is your team. Uh, let's switch to Channel Flame. Let's switch it up a little bit. Oh, there's a Froggy! Oh, well. So basically what you do, you go into the tall grass and train your Pokemon. You go on up with your Pokemon and then you can train and train your opponent for the next team battle. Or you have a really strong opponent and I'll try to train your Pokemon first. Um, this is a Mega Stone. I really, really look like a Mega Stone. Uh, uh, basically, when I played the original Fire Red, at least when I thought I was going to have a Mega When Red and Blue and Fire Red and Blue Green came out, there was no Mega Evolution, so I never thought it was supposed to be a Mega Stone in the first place. So you trade Pokemon. Uh, basically, you can see Pokemon that is weak in here in front of you. Um, so basically, you're going to your Pokemon and you're going to shoot up to your level. And that is what you're actually going to do. I, cannot, I think I'm going to hit my Pokemon first. So it's my Pokemon almost going to get it out. Because basically that is what you do. You go through the tall grass and you fight Pokemon. And since Radical Red is really difficult and I try to destroy your Pokemon uh because it's too much for the time. But I fight I fought Brock, that was really really difficult, so uh, the best way to defeat a stronger enemy is to make a Pokemon stronger. Don't make them too strong, uh, to make it to uh, uh, to make it too easy for you. Um, but the wild Pokemon has also uh, um, I don't do a few battles just, uh, to show you uh to show you my point. And my teleplane is almost level 15, so that is good. You don't have to be a telephone to break off because you're going to go outside. But since it is randomized, you never know what the problem is. So you have to go to different items and see what is what the work, what is the work, and what 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 works best for you. Obviously, uh, radical red is the difficulty to roam actually now, so a little bit, for, a little bit, uh, a little bit, uh, a little bit. Uh, It's not uh, always looking at that. Uh, when you go into a very positive look about my, my, my teleport is almost up to uh, 15. There are also uh, games in this game that I show you when I'm a little bit further and I show you how the game works. Uh, it's basically like a certain shield. When you beat a Pokemon, you can get the Pokemon more uh, you can uh, go to the game. Can I show you the dance in the next video? Um, in this video, go into the game and then in the same way. So that's why I was going high enough to beat the game. That is why I show you the original Fire Red Edition, I wish you could say something like that. It's just easy to do with it. You know, the thing that you have high enough of it is not the same as well. It's all just too strong enough. So you have to sit down the problem that the problem is going to be high enough. Uh, so, what you 
what do you know? My seven flag is now. Uh, let's go one more time today. Yeah, almost there. And now you continue to progress, and then you play the Pokemon, just like that. Yeah. Just like that. Oh, this is even a jiggly bug, what do you know? Oh, now you got 1 HP. Well, 1, one experience is not going to help. Even a barbaric hole is here. I'm going to be that. Of course, it's going to use uh, self, uh, self -match. Well, uh... Well, maybe uh, it does only 2 HP because to make, it, to make it more difficult. You cannot uh, trade higher and you probably want uh, the highest... Uh... Let's try mine. Uh, let's try uh... And then I show you the actual gym battle that I'm not going to do it all. It's very, very difficult, so you can play Pokemon as much as possible. I show you the actual gym battle um, Brock and then I can end the video. I was only to, uh, to show you to see I have to level up amazing, but I think it was a gym battle uh, and the gym is not. Let me show you the gym battle. It's really, really difficult. Well, let's go focus on a little high, I think. Well, that's not going to Do you know? Do you use any items in here? It's pointless. You literally want to my team. So that is how difficult it is, just like that. Uh, I, gotta, I gotta train a little bit more. I gotta defeat two or three Pokemon and then I'm gonna end the video right here. I don't play the game, I'm sure you need to level up before you take on the board. You see how they are. How difficult it is just like that. Well, that's the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you need uh, any technical advice, uh, the gym battle was all to show you that you need to be strong to put the next gym. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Drop a like, show some love, and a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.